Hi, this is Kevin Lee. In this presentation, I will show you how to test data direct JDBC connection using Squirrel SQL Client. Now we are in Squirrel uh, website. Squirrel SQL Client is a web-based tool. It's a GUI-based, so it's nice. It gives a nice GUI, so it's easier to test the connectivity. So if you are having problem, for example, let's say. Uh, your domain connection, uh, your domain is uh, running on Oracle or DB2, and if Data Direct JDBC connection fails, you can always use uh, Squirrel client and test the connectivity outside Informatica. Or let's say uh, data service, if your Informatica developer tool, uh, you're having problem with the Informix and you're having problem with the Data Direct JDBC driver, then you can always use this tool to test the same connectivity outside Informatica. So uh, just click on this link, then uh, you will see install jars of Squirrel 3.5 for Windows, Linux, or any other uh, Unix, uh, Unix platform. So notice that this is jar file, it's a Java program, it's uh, always independent. So you can always um, use Linux or any Unix platforms. However, it's a GUI based tool, so um, you need to have an X window. Otherwise, uh, Windows, you can always use it, of course. Now, I will show you the connectivity, um, and I will use uh, data, the JDBC driver that comes with the power center, uh, 951. So, for 951, Go to um, services slash share slash jar slash third party. That's where you can find all the third party jar files. For um, this presentation, I will use uh, Data Direct JDB, uh, JDBC driver for DB2, which is this one. So simply copy this file and then put it under uh, where you install Squirrel Client. So in my case, um, it's under program files slash scroll SQL, um, whatever the version, slash lib. So just copy there. So I just copy the file here. And now open, after that, just open scroll. First, go to driver section and then click on uh, plus sign and then find the data that JDBC that you just copied, which is this one. Now you have to provide a class name for the data that JDBC for DB2, which you can find from this KB. So uh, for DB2, this is the class name. So, so it's just simply copy it. By the way, this is another test utility, uh, JDBC test. So you can also test the connection using this tool. So I just provided it and then just give any name for it. And then provide the URL. For this test connection, I just use this one. Uh, for uh, if you're having problem, for example, let's say you're having problem with that uh, Informatica personal domain, uh, whatever the JDBC connection you can find from the uh, node metadata XML, which is located under uh, Informatica install slash ISP slash config. There you will uh, find node metadata XML. There you can see the uh, DB2 connect string. So I just opened the node manager XML under the PowerCenter install so, uh, ISP slash config. There you will see DB string, DB connect string. That's where you can find the uh, connect string for the uh, URL for the database connection. Notice that once you create the drivers, you can see a check mark there and the file is created. You can see that. After that, go to, go to aliases and create a new alias. 
here uh, point to the driver that you just created now um, just uh, give any name give it to I say alias and then just provide a DB username and password here first uh, see if the test connection works fine so just click on test and then click on connect now it shows that the test connection is successful click OK now if you click OK then uh, uh, the alias is created now I will connect to the database now you see uh, the connection works fine now so the test connection is successful for the database so that's how you can test the connection um, the branding name for the JDBC driver that, that comes with Informatica are here and you can also find the same information from our KB so um, you can all, uh, also uh, the one KB article that I showed you, showed you earlier it's called JDBC test utility um, you can use this tool to test the connection as well just that SQL uh, JDBC client tool is just gives a nice uh, looking uh, GUI based tool so it may be easier for you to test the connection and also this KB shows the JDBC, uh, the second KB this one shows the JDBC URL and driver it's for some other application but they are using JDBC, JDBC so pretty much the same so you can just look at this KB as well and third one um, uh, this KB is for uh, Informatica SQL data service but it uses Quora JDBC driver as well so uh, you can look at this KB just so you uh, have more important information about the Quora JDBC client utility and so you can be more familiar with the tool That's about it for the presentation for to test the connection using Scora um, SQL client. Um, feel free to just give any feedback to us. Thank you.